Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new here, I welcome you. I'm extremely excited to share with you all this unboxing. This box arrived today. And first, let me explain the reason for my excitement. If you guys did not know, Dairy Queen, yes, Dairy Queen, released a special candle collection inspired by their fall blizzard treats. I found out this information from a lovely YouTuber that I currently follow. Her YouTube is Aromatic Aesthetic. She's such a lovely individual. You guys got to go check out her YouTube channel. And she shared that this collection will be dropping September 3rd. Dairy Queen actually released a collection last year for the first time. And it was first come, first serve. No charge for the collection. However, that collection sold out in like 30 minutes. So this year, they're back with a lineup of six candles, Blizzard Treat inspired, and I'm just dying to share this with you all. I have no idea what to expect, so let's just jump into this unboxing and get right to it. I'm so excited, guys. And this collection um, was $25 for a set of six. And then I will also chat with you all about the process and how stressful it was. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I'm so excited. Okay, do you guys see that? Wow, I mean, I can't believe, and I would have never thought DQ would have released any kind of candle, anything. So let's just take a look at the box. The new Fall Blizzard collection, and this is the, of course, 2020 collection. And how do I open it here? Let's see. I'm working with one hand, guys, so bear with me. Okay, guys, here we go. And it says, it's official, fall is in the air. Do you smell it? The sniff of pumpkin, caramel apple. What else is in here? Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna read all this, but I definitely do like how they package everything. Okay, nothing on the back. Oh, wow. And here we go. Here's the lineup of six. And these, I believe are four ounce, can four ounce candles. Let's see. Does it say anywhere on here? I don't think so. I believe they are four ounces, I believe. However, the first one is Snickerdoodle Cookie Dough Blizzard. Sweet dough notes unbaked to perfection with hints of cinnamon and a great nose feel. Wow. Okay. The next one is Pumpkin Pie Blizzard whiffs of pumpkin, vanilla, pie crust, and happiness carry you to the pumpkin patch. And I love the packaging. And it's just a sticker, but I do like that. Very fall-like. Here we have Oreo Mocha Fudge Blizzard. Essence of a cozy cafe meets your favorite cookie meets your nose. Oh, wow. I bet that's going to smell amazing. That mocha and that Oreo. And caramel apple pie. Fresh baked scents of drizzled caramel, homemade pie crust, and orchard picked apples minus the latter. <laughs> I like that. And that's the top. I love how they have the picture of the blizzard on the candle. So cool. And all the um, proceeds go to, 100% of the proceeds go to the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals, which I think is phenomenal. The next one is Choco Dipped Strawberry Blizzard. Breathtaking notes of sweet strawberries straight from the farm. 
but also melted chocolate. Oh my gosh, I love strawberry. I know I'm gonna love this one. Okay, and last we have brownie dough blizzard, aromatic wisps of homemade brownie dough baked for zero minutes. Okay, guys, let me see if I could get these open. And they're pretty easy to open. Take that out of there. And as you can see, the wax is white. And this is the Snickerdoodle cookie dough. Oh my gosh, it smells like Snickerdoodle. It does smell like cookie. Mm, and I smell the, I do smell the cinnamon. They're not strong, like super strong in your face. It smells exactly how it's advertised. I smell the cinnamon and I smell the snickerdoodle cookie. Definitely smells like it's advertised. All right, let's go on to pumpkin pie blizzard. Oh my gosh, this one smells amazing. It smells exactly like pumpkin pie, like ice cream. So far, this one is my favorite. Oh my gosh. The, the pumpkin spice in this candle smells so good. I'm really happy about this one. Okay, on to Oreo Mocha Fudge Blizzard. I'm so excited, like I'm shaking. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, I smell brownie. I smell coffee, which is the mocha. Oh wow, I, this one smells stronger than the rest. And it could be the, the mocha and the fudge. It's very chocolatey. Oh God, I've got to give it another sniff. Oh my gosh, my kids are gonna fall out, literally. <laughs> okay, all right, we have brownie dough blizzard. Cool thing that these are easy to open because I'm only working with one hand. Okay, this smells very brownie, creamy, doughy. And yeah, it does smell like baked brownie dough. Definitely. That one is good. Oh my gosh. Like what on earth were they thinking? All right, on to Choco Dip Strawberry Blizzard. Okay, okay, maybe I lied about the pumpkin spice. This one is my favorite. The chocolate and the strawberry, the sweetness in the strawberry is so good. Like, these smell like they could be eaten. <laughs> oh my gosh, this smells so good. The chocolate, um, it's a, these are really good blends. The chocolate with the strawberry. The strawberry is more prominent on this one, which I'm really glad about. Um, yeah, this one smells phenomenal. Okay, on to the last one. Caramel Apple Pie Blizzard. Okay, that is very smooth. I get, oh my God. I get the caramel and I get the, it smells like fresh picked apple. Yeah. I really don't get a like pie note or any kind of like crust note. I just get caramel apple. But um, perhaps when burned, maybe I'll pick up maybe a like crust or like a more graham cracker or pie scent. But on cold, I just get caramel and apple. And this one smells good too. It's kind of on the light side. 
but yeah really excited about this collection um i have not seen any reviews on these um just a little bit about my process with getting these because it was very stressful i was on the site at 3 p.m eastern time to order and <laughs> i actually upon logging in well being on the site it prompted it opened up for us to purchase and immediately i was prompted to put in my email address which was strange because it's like it said enter your email you'll be notified when the candles become available which was strange because at that time it was exactly 3 p.m so i thought maybe we could just go straight through the site and place the order however um at about 301 i actually got through to view the collection and the cart actually opened up for me to enter my information and how many quantities i wanted got all the way through to entering my payment information and got the sold out <laughs> notification that these were sold out so i'm like how is that because at that time it had to be like 302 or 301 at that point and I refreshed my screen went back again and again same thing sold out for at least three minutes but I was determined not to give up it was really frustrating I had to keep refreshing my screen and at about 30 I would say about 304 it opened back up again available for purchase so I instantly added a quantity of three to my cart, as you can see here, and entered my payment information and boom, <laughs> I got a notification that um, sent to my email that my order had been placed. So at that point, I was able to take a deep breath. However, that process was stressful. It took me about four, four and a half minutes to um, get these to, just to be successful in ordering these candles so guys I think definitely with the proceeds going to the children's the Miracle Children's Network hospitals I definitely think it's it was definitely worth the stress guys and I'm really happy to have these really excited to try these out I definitely will do a review on the six you guys let me know down below if you had heard about this collection did you guys uh, get on the site or attempt to try to place an order i knew nothing about this collection like i said i learned about it from the lovely aromatic aesthetic um i haven't seen any reviews on them so i'm really hoping that these perform well and um if so i will be looking forward to purchasing them um next year to come so yeah guys that is everything for this unboxing i placed an order of three sets um i forgot to mention that each set was 25 dollars each so a total of 75 dollars for three sets and i'm really happy to have these so guys leave me some comments below what do you think about this collection had you heard anything about it and if you enjoy videos like this be sure to hit that like button hit also your notification bell and subscribe and i will talk to you in my next video guys bye